Okay, so when we're looking here, uh, this question asks, what are the products of the following acid-base reaction? Draw the mechanism, okay? So it's actually a multi-step question. Um, but uh, in order to draw that mechanism, you really should decide which one's the stronger of the two acids. Although the nitrogen doesn't have any lone pair electrons on it. So you know it can't be the base, okay? okay so either way, you know, this, this thing over here is going to be the base, the ester over here, okay? But the best thing to do either way, no matter what you know, is to look at your um, pKa table and it'll tell you which one's going to be the acid and which one's going to be the base. How would you know which one's going to be the acid? It's going to have the what pK? The lower pK, right? Okay, so if you don't know that, make sure you know that before a couple weeks from now. Okay, so you got to look at the pKa table. It will be given to you, okay? So um, what's the pKa of uh, protonated ammonia? Does anybody see that on there? Yeah. Ten. So, yeah. Yeah, I like to put plus ten just to remind myself because pKa can go back and forth from plus to minus. Okay, and what about an ester? So this is not a protonated ester or anything, it's just a regular ester, right? It's a protonated ester, right? Does anybody else see any other ester on there? Is it the 25? Yeah, it's the 25 one. Alpha hydrogen. Why? Because the alpha hydrogen is the most acidic hydrogen on the ester. You guys know that. So anyways, which one is the stronger acid? The one on the right or the left? The right, right? Because it's low, okay? So this is going to be the base, okay? In um, these uh, carboxylic acid derivatives, if you've got an electron donating group, right, the base is going to be, it's usually going to be this car uh, carbonyl oxygen. Especially, I guess, if you have an electron donating group, I should say. So, so in other words, you better not be writing the mechanism from this oxygen. Okay. So, now we don't know what the equilibrium arrows are yet. We're going to put those in later. But we do know the product, so go ahead and write the product. better if you did it without my help. But. Right. Okay, so now what is this thing here? Oh. Yeah, protonated ester. And what did we say its pKa was? Negative six. And what is this thing here? Ammonia, right? And what's its pKa? Right. Use my table, please. 35. 35. Okay. So, which is the acid on this side? The left or the right? The right. So this is the acid, right? So this must be the... Okay. Acid or base? Tell me. Acid is left. So the base must be here, right? Okay, so out of the acids, which one is the stronger of the two acids? The one on the right, or the product acid, or the reactant acid? Product acid is the strong acid, right? So this must be the weaker of the acids, right? Um, which one's the stronger base? The one on the right. Right? Because the bigger the number is the stronger the base. So this is the weaker. 
So already you should be able to predict which way the arrows are going, right? To the Why? You always want to go from over to uh, a strong acid. Yeah, because a strong acid is what? Relatively something to this. The weak acid. Relatively unstable. Uh, right? That's why reactions occur. Okay? So um, now we can figure out, well, what's the KEQ, right? I mean, this is just qualitative. Right? We can actually figure it out and then definitely say what this is. And that's what we're going to do. So the KEQ, I gave you an equation of how to do that, right? What is that? The KA of the reactant acid divided by KA of the product acid. So do we know those numbers? What's the KA of the reactant acid? 10, well, it's always 10 to the negative pK, okay? So in this case, it's 10 to the negative what? 10. 10. And below that is what? Help me out, guys. 10 to the negative. Uh, to the negative, negative 6, right? Which is going to be the positive 6. So the KEQ of this, if, the, if we're predicting this, right, the KEQ should be what? Less than, greater than, equal to, what should it be? We're predicting this. Less than, less less than, than what? Than. One. Okay. You have to look at the, the paper already to see that. You need to know this. You should know this stuff for a while. Right? So less than one. What is the KEQ of here? Yeah, so 1 times 10 to the negative 16. Is that less than 1? Does that go with our prediction? That the strong acid goes to the weak acid, or the strong things go to the weak things, right? Because those are more unstable. So this, no units, by the way, tells you that this is what you're looking for. Okay? So, um, uh, the last thing is, again, we've already said this, which side does the reaction um, favor, equilibrium favor, and it's the reactants. Okay. Any questions before we kill this one?